Hey friends, Sandra here and welcome to the Sassy Club. Oh yeah, be sure and click the subscribe button so you can become a Sassy Club member. Because <laughs> you know you want to be part of this craziness. And yeah, let's crack this little baby open and see all the wondrous things it holds inside. It's like a little genie in a bottle, except it's a planner in a box. I don't know if that made any sense, but I'm going with it. <laughs> I really love how this thing looks right out of the box. It just feels like really good quality. It comes with this adorable camera charm. And I'm just kind of like in awe of it and I did a little close-up here so you guys could kind of see what the texture looks like and what the stitching looks like because I don't know about you guys but I'm kind of a little bit anal about having the stitching and the leather kind of look nice to me especially since I know before when I've gotten Kiki K's I've had like little bits that kind of stick out a little bit on the stitching or something like that and I'm kind of like um hello for $80 you should look pretty nice just saying record most of my kiki case have been pretty nice it's just been little details like that they kind of like bring out my ocd the first thing i look at too is the rings from a planner i like them to be nice and tight with no gaps because when you have a gap then your papers get stuck in that gap and it's no fun i promise and i love the little pockets you get for cards and then you get a little area for stickers behind that i do wish it kind of had a zipper but I still think it's pretty nice. I also love the dashboard. I love that it's see-through with the words and then you get that little watercolory look to it. I also just love the way this is designed. It has a lot of fun colors, but it's also not too over the top because I really enjoy customizing my pages. So it kind of takes the fun out of it a little bit for me when there's like too much going on. But I really love this planner so far and I love how the monthly overview is pretty plain because you can really add things to it. And you also, um, it also comes undated, which is awesome because if you're like me and have several planners it gives you time to really use it without feeling rushed and I also love that this is actually horizontal which I didn't expect and you also get that same page that you get um, in your happy planner which is just like the overview before the month starts where you can write little notes or bills you have to pay for that week which is really cool and I feel like I'm gonna have a little bit of a learning curve with using horizontal versus vertical when I try this out but I do think that it is really nice and I'm looking forward to that and like I said they have such cute little details every one of these dividers looks different and has such fun designs you get lots of stripes and hearts and florals and fun colors and they all match really well together even though they're different which I love and you get little quotes as well um, little areas for notes in the back of every weekly I'm kind of just skimming through it showing you guys the little details that come in it I love this floral one right here it's so pretty you guys it's even prettier in person like I'm yeah I heart that really badly and you can even stick something on top of that, like a Project Life card with washi tape. There's lots of fun things you can do with this planner. And if you guys want to see me maybe do like a plan with me in the Simple Stories planner, just let me know and I will try to make that happen. I will also try to leave a link in the description box below where you can purchase this as well. I just really thought it would be fun to share this with you guys and share kind of like my first impressions when opening it. That's another month right there. Again, everyone is kind of just different and that's why I decided to show them to you you guys without spending too much time in one area and here's another beautiful floral that I'm obsessed with <laughs> I just literally love everything that comes in this planner I feel like it's kind of whimsical but not like too whimsical where it looks childish at least to me anyway but then again I am a big kid so what am I talking about <laughs> I love how that one area has that little like rainbow of colors. I love this one divider with the pencils and pens. I think that is so adorable. I just want a, a cover with that on it pretty much. And I'm just kind of like just in awe of this. I just think it's just made for me. I just think it's so pretty. And I'm going to repeat myself a lot because it's just so cute. And I just wanted to show you guys basically how it all goes together and all the little designs so pretty much that's what I'm showing you here and I promise I'm almost to the end right here and then this just has polka dots and florals which hashtag winning <laughs> I know a couple of y'all who are probably going to be drooling over this and the great thing is too is I've seen a little like group of people who have mixed and matched these and put these in other planners as well these inserts are just really cute so I don't even know yet what I'm going to do um, per se as far as using this because I'm kind of figuring out what I'm doing for 2016 because I've really been loving using my Erin Condren planner and as you guys know I did an unboxing of that too so I will leave a link if I remember. <laughs> if my memory serves me. <laughs> but again more pens and pencil kind of design and yeah and then the back just has really cute designs as well. I wish those were stickers though. Kind of sort of. 
then you get this little notepad and I love that it has little holes so you can kind of connect it into your planner like if you write some notes and you want to just add it into a month or a week you can do that so I thought that was really genius you get a little pen loop right there which is also nice and it's elastic so I figure most pens will fit in there as long as they're not too much um, as long as they're not too chunky and yeah, I hope I could talk fine on this. And that little white paper that's hanging by the rings, that is removable, just so you guys know. I just didn't remove it because I didn't really think about it too much while I was doing this. And I basically opened this on camera with y'all, so that's that's how the story goes. Anyway, if you guys have any comments or questions, leave them down below. If you want to see more things like this, also let me know. I also wanted to show you guys how it looks in comparison to the Kiki K as far as size, because originally it kind of felt larger to me in my hands, but maybe that's because I've been using a spiral bound planner for a while now and I haven't been using as much my Kiki K's and kind of like more leather binder type style planners but as you can see the Kiki K actually looks a little bit bigger on camera um, but honestly they do feel the same in my hand they don't feel any bigger and I also compared my Erin Condren planner to it and I will try to leave a link to that as well in the description box below because I think it all has to do with what you kind of like or you could like everything like I do but yeah I was just kind of comparing it it's pretty much like the same size even though the Erin Condren obviously does feel lighter because it's not like a binder system it's a notebook system for a planner so that's just kind of like a little quick comparison for you guys just to see what the difference kind of looks like but I feel like overall they're almost about the same size so you could kind of go for it either way and I believe that the simple stories planner is in the price range of like $50 or so I could be wrong but I will leave a link for you guys if you want to check that out I know it's definitely cheaper than Kiki K and as always you guys thank you so much for watching be sure and subscribe and become part of the sassy club sassy 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 Sassy! <laughs> anyway, you guys, yeah, I hope you enjoyed this, and I will see you guys again soon. Bye!